All about Symbian and Mobile Industry Review. So this is Arunav, Arunav Ankur, and I happen to be a technology specialist here in the foundation. I sit in the technology management team and I work closely with the OSN-based services and multimedia and graphics. I also happen to be the package owner of BeagleBoard and I'm coordinating all the efforts towards Wild Ducks and the plan. BeagleBoard is basically a TI OMAP solution which is a very cheap solution for developers around the world working and making prototype hardware or for product enthusiasts to come up with their own solutions and own devices. It's an OMAP processor based solution from TI, which is a sub hundred, it's, it's hundred, hundred dollars or something. So the way WildX started that, we knew that we, we had a lot of code here in Symbian which is actually capable of making a true phone. And then we had options like BeagleBoard, which is a very powerful platform and could realize what all you could do on an actual phone. So we all thought, okay, well, why, why don't we come up with a concept of a garage phone saying that, why don't we come up with a phone for the community and by the community? So this is something in which we, we, it, it, we started it internally, but we liked it with everyone else in the community and in the ecosystem, dropping in, raising their hands, saying, oh, I want to do this thing, and we together make a phone which is open, just so that everyone can use it, everyone can make a copy of it and customize it for their own things. It's, and the platform is very, very, very powerful, which I'll say. So if you see an N900, it's the kind of same platform what we have on BeagleBoard. So technically, if, if you want to come up with a good phone, uh, you can do everything possible, which is possible on an N900, or more than that on an N97, for that reason, with a free, all available code, so that anyone can do it, whether it's garage developers, university students, enthusiasts like me or anyone else. Yes, yes. So, see, Symbian has anyway proven it very well that it can ship phones. What we are trying to prove is that now anyone can do it with the open code. So anyone with off-shelf components can try and build a phone. We have a wiki out there where we actually explain what all someone has to do to replicate the whole thing. It's an open wiki with um, having things what we missed today, things what we we'll like to do in future, like what we have today is a beagle board working with a keyboard and a mouse and we use our monitors, LCD monitors for the display. But uh, we'll definitely like to see LCD touch screen panels working there. We'd like to see more sophisticated touch panels working, uh, maybe Wi-Fi, net browsing. So this is also we have listed it down there that what are the open areas where others can contribute and engage with us. But for today, whatever we have, anyone can replicate it and the steps are there on the wiki itself. To start off, actually, it's, it's Daniel Rubio, the chief architect here. So he bumped this idea that we guys, why, why don't we guys work with our own code and off-shelf hardware to do something? He had an old modem at home. He told, I'll, I'll get my stuff from home. He, he got his old modem. We had a beagle board in-house. We used that. Went to Maplin, bought a few more things. Got the kind of basic stuff up. And then we, we, we kind of went out like-minded guys saying, okay, why don't, why don't we stay on Tuesday then after work? Because we definitely work on other things and other priorities here in the foundation. So we thought, okay, why, why don't we stay out after Tuesdays and tr try working for the cows? And that's how it all started. The foundation was kind enough to fund pizzas for us. Okay, you guys stay and work, we'll, we'll give you pizza. Then started working that way. Slowly more and more guys joined in. So right now we have seven to eight guys from the foundation itself. Moving ahead, we had guys from Accenture helping us, so they were handy and they, they, they offered help and it was very kind of them to come down here and help and moving ahead now, we plan to host the same Tuesdays what we had our Pizza Tuesdays as Hackers Evening, where we are actually going to offer pizzas to everyone who so is interested to come and join us, have a discussion, have a look at BeagleBoard and what we are doing with that, have a discussion, have a chat, have some ideas, contribute, let's start working. And uh, what's your preference, Domino's or Pizza? It's Domino's because Domino's has two on Tuesdays. So we work on Tuesdays, so if you order two pizzas, you get two free, so it's Domino's. <laughs>
<laughs> works well for the foundation. Anyway, we are a non-profit organization after all. <laughs> Tune for more at All About Symbian at Mobile Industry Review.